circumstances mumbera zonna ngo mutima gwe gwagala mukama his heart loved the lord but some of us when we are well off our hearts nezisese tuka nejisese tuka nejiva katonda but some of us when we are well off when we have everything we need our hearts drift away from the lord when we are deep in trouble we drift away from the lord ngatuli mumbere nzibwe nyu ezireto bulumi tuduka ne tuvate kumukama but this is what david says na yechi no daudi cha gamba psalms 80 86 Zabuli chinana mumukaga line 11 Olunyore 10 no lumu Teach me your way O Lord I will walk in your truth Unite my heart to fear your name Onjigirizenga ekubolyo ai mukama na atambuliranga mmazima go ogatewa mu mutima gwange gutie elinyalyo Ani ali ayozizo mutima gwa Daudi aliyokagambe unite my heart who had who had uh, spread the heart of David that he prayed to the Lord to unite his heart you know sometimes you can be in your heart when when ngo mutima gwo gulie no gulieri obo yuzidwa maybe there are wounds you know i don't want to talk about a, a broken heart because you have heard much about the broken heart and and i know <laughs> let me say this I know you know that by experience. Sagala kuogera ku mtimo ogumenyese kubanga gogedwa ko nyo. Atenchi manyi omanyo mtimo ogwo olokubanga oguyisi obadde ko nago by experience. You know how to same nyo to have a broken heart. Ero manche kitegeza okubera no mtimo ogumenyese. All of us have been there. Fena tubadde yeyo. But when David was there, he says unite my heart. Ne David bwe yali mu kisere echo agama anti ogatto mutima gwange He says I will praise you O Lord my God with all my heart and I will I will glorify your name forever Na kutendelezanga ai mukama katonda wange no mutima gwange gonna era na agulumizanga elinyalyo emirembe jonna Psalms 34 Zaburi ya 3 munya 18 olunyore 18 34 asatu munya 18 this is what he says what we agamba the lord is near to those who have a broken heart Mukama and save such as have a contrite spirit mukama ali kumpi nabo abali no mutima ogumenyese era awonya abali no moyo ogubonerede now na uh, 18a 18 akatundu akasoka is fulfilled by 18b katukirizibwa 18 akatundu akoku the lord is near to those who have a broken heart Mukama ali kumpi nabo abali no mutima ogumenyese and he can save those who have a contrite spirit era wonya abali no moyo ogubonerede oyino kubanga obonerede oyino kubanga we waddeyo oyino kubanga omuyaya anira oyino kubanga omweta aga mu mutima gwo kakati bwoba wamenyike wamenye bwo mutima awo nali okakulokola You must be having a contrite spirit, a heart that is ready to be to be saved, then he will come and save your soul. The heart that yearns after God. Omutima oguyayanira katonda. Twagula ba ku Daudi. Actually that was the reason as to why he was chosen. We saw it with David that and that is the era in Songarachi. Yalondebwa He says the Lord says I have seen a man whose heart is after my heart Mukama agama ntindabyo msajja alina omutima ogugoberera ogwange He wants the heart he sees in the heart Ayagala mitima era tunulira mitima The book of Jeremiah chapter 3 verses 15 Ekitabo cha Yeremia esule yokusatu He says I will give you pastors after according to my heart 
Agama tingenda kuwa kuwa wabasumba abali no mutima ogugobele rogwangi. Those who will, teach, who will teach you with truth and knowledge. Abana abasome sangana mazima no, no kumanya. Hallelujah. Amen. Still it is the issue of the heart. Eran songa ya mutima. I pray that the Lord examines our hearts. Nsaba, timukama akebire mitima jafe. Let me read my last scriptures. Can some say and these scriptures okay they are about the covenant of the Lord. Binebya wandikiwa bikwata kundagano ya mukama. The new covenant endagane mpya that he says he's going to make with us. Jaga manti agenda kujikola na fe. And he says I'll make it in the heart. Era gamba ngenda kujikola mu mitima. The book of Jeremiah chapter 32 cha Yeremia sura ya 32 verses 33 He says but this is my covenant that I will make with the house of Israel after those days says the Lord I'll put my laws in their minds and write it on their hearts and I will be their God and they shall be my people no more shall every man teach his neighbor and every man his brother saying know the Lord for they all shall know me from the least of them to the greatest of them says the Lord for I will forgive their iniquity and their sin will I remember no more Sorry, Okay. Yeremia Nabo Banabanga Bantu Bangi. Thirty two forty. Asatumu Bidi Orunyorana. He says, And I will make a new everlasting covenant with them, and I will not turn away from doing them good, but I will put my fear in their hearts so that they will not depart from me. Ntira, ndira gana nabo indagano eteri gwao, obuta chuka, okubaleka, okubako lobulunji. Eda ndite kenti sayange mumitima jawe, balemo kumva ako. That is the operation that we need. Eyo ye, okukwe kulongo sewa kwe tuetaga. He says in the book of Psalms 51 verse 10. Agamba muzabuli atano mwewe mu, olunio rekumi. David was praying and he said, Created me an, a, a clean heart, O God. Daudi ya saba na gama, anti ontonde mu umtimo umuja, ayi mukama. And renew an upright spirit within me. Era ozebu jo moyo murunji. We need yangi. a new covenant with the Lord. Tueta agenda gane mpya. We ni need mukama. him to write again on our hearts. Tumueta goku damo kuandika kumitima jafe. We need him to... To me, to, if, if it is impossible that our hearts cannot be mended, that he may create a brand new heart. We gubange mitima jafete jicha asobu la kulongo sewa. Olo tumusabe ateke momu timu omuja. Hallelujah. Amen. May God bless you. Mukama aba wenyo mukisa. As we are going to pray. Ngabwe tugendo kusaba. I pray that the grace may help you. Nsabie echi sachikuyambe. That you, you may not oleme kuba banga. That you may not hit the the space. Obere focused. That you will be focused. In most cases, obuzibuwe tu kola. Emirundi eji singo obunje even obuzibuwe tu kola. We tu genda masogam kama. When we go before the Lord, tetuwe galida mo bisenge. We don't lock ourselves in the in inside. Such that we can pray the truth of our hearts. 
Prayer is not prayer until when you've spoken the truth of your heart. Boyogera mazima go mutima omoyo mtu kuvuwaja na kugaziza o kusaba na kuyamba ko. When you speak the truth of your heart, that is when the Holy Spirit will come and enable you in prayer and also to guide you. Kubanga Bible yegamba antifete tumanyu kusabanga wechitu guanira. Because the Bible says that we cannot pray as we ought to. Na yu moyo mtu kuvuatu yamba. But the Holy Spirit helps us. Atu yamba, atu takaba nila ko. He helps us with interceding. That's when ngatumazo kwe, kwe galira yo, ngatumazo kwe composinga. Netuwa njuluza amazima gali momiti majafemaso gomu inza webi ntubyo na. When we have locked ourselves inside, that we are able to speak the truth of our hearts. Bobanga gwe uyo anonye ndagane mpia ni katonda. If you're the one who desires a new covenant with the Lord. Nga gwe uyo ayetago mutimo omulala maso ga katonda. And you're the one who needs a new heart from the, from the Lord. Zibiri za maso go. Close your eyes. Bobo sobola. If you can. And dedicate your heart. Oweyo omutima gojari. Oku sabate waku wanda bigambo mkamwa. They don't spit words into your mouth if you're to pray. Oh, you get a mutimago. You just speak the truth of your heart. Mukama to kweta gaka unges kurwa lero. To kweta gira dala. Nange nkweta aga mkama. Tunula munda mufi mkama utu yambe. Oyambe mitima jafe yesu. Uli katonda atu yamba no tusanu ule mitima. Echo chilavu chicho guochi gaba. Nkwe taga mkama. Nkwe taga. Nkwe taga mkama. Nkwe taga. Kwe taga, mukama, kwe taga, umoyo gwange guone. Kwe taga, mukama, kwe taga, kwe taga, mukama, kwe taga, kwe taga, kwe taga. Mama kweta goyo gwange moyo gwange gwange buone kweta ga kweta go mama kweta ga kweta ga kweta ga mama kweta ze kweta ga kweta ga Oh uh -huh. 
Mwana
Tuwa lechi bichi ange Tuwa lobu fundu wange mukama Tuwa lobu nonefu wango wa mutima Tuwa lama kese ganga mabi Aga tula mbina wazo vyange Kwe gaili te tuwa lemu landila kwe chibi wevu limba Tuwa lechi fundu wa chidi munda yange Kama umutima guange vuli olucha Jagala kuchuke Na yewe netu nulida sinda bako wada katono Atenga sagala kusigala Atenga sagala ondeke Wadi wale sama nenga matambu lenga wache chikala wachiteka Wadi wale sama nenga mba wakili kusange mkubo Wadi wale nga mba wakili oche kuchitanda change Na ye mkama Chibichicha tula munda muse Kwe gaili den sasira Sasira olio koje weche bika Sasi olio kori kula maso gange kakulabe Makoli saga manti na ukutu sakati Baba samire vya mosa ni bata vitegera Kubanga kumda uza zaba kuli kechi vika Emiti majafe jivikitwa Omti magwange guvikitwa mkama Na ye chimbika chivi Chimbika bulimba Chimbika butari wesigwa Chimbika ulutalolo munda Chimbika kono neka kwange Omti magwange njagala kulongoke Omti magwange njagala kutukule Nazano msaigo sigo yogete mjisaya Timuje Tutese fembi Mujobu viva mwene mwemu na mamgabu Mungabu linga mwobu viva mungabu Butu wakate nge pendela Naba nongo sane muwe na ngo mzira Mukama nongo sa Kweka hili densa sila Kweka hili denso nyuwa Dawidi ya yogera mkuro nikoze soka Nagamati mukama sa sila Kangwe mumi kono jo Nange ngute mumi kono jo Onsa sila onji jeke chibika Echevi komu tima guange chivi Onsasile musasizi mukama Kumango chari kuntabe yoku sasila Kwega hili dome mbule kechevi ka Echevi kecho mfundi mukama Kwega hili kato na anga jude chisano kusasila Mukama onsasile nze Mukama chinzi hizo kulaba na maso chibi Chizi hizo kunye gedo muti mago chibi change Bachi change cheba kola nange viende kola la Budi olu change kala kufana na mukama Budi olu change kala kusembe la uli Budi olu change kala nyingine muti mago Na ye mukama chibi change Chita da omu maso gonsa sile Kwe gaidi dona seno msayo ntukuze Kwe gaidi dono ngosa zetala katu na wango mulunji kwe gairi don tu kuzeno msayo gogwa ika kumusala begolo gosa yuge na mweza kedi no gamba ti wansanga andezi ni wansa mwama sayi ngachari kone chilira nanda manga mwani lo kwa galibwa yesu kwe gairi tenze Onongo senze noga mantimbe mulamu Don salire chilira Salira nolwa lelo nadamu nene ziribanga mububi Kama naza no msai nongo sa Ebido oze vita muze bibi Ebido oze vita muze bibi fundu Onsa zido sonyi wa mkwano Kama nkwega hili te Kwega te kwa baba la uwasa uvulunji Buda hudi na luguza kunyumba ya mkama Nasa ni na jana mkama ntikolecho kubanga chidunji Mkama no mtu mino mbaka no yogena ni kufiucha ye Kubanga chidunji ya ina chidunji Nange, nange muti magu wange mwede nge 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 mw
Chinge <laughs> Chichen <laughs> Chinja, 
Echo chenja galanze Echo chenja yanilo Kebeno mtima Umanyi chenja gala Jagala kwesebo Ojule munda mtima Gwange Chiri achifana nyimwe na tondevo Echo chenja galina Dala mtima gwange Kwe gairi Deka tondo mlonji Kwe chibe chamba lo chenge Kama nga chichari mwa mamala Chinani za dala Soga la chuku ziza Soga la chuku gari na mwenu ze Soga la chuku ndake sama mega sabo Soga la chuku zikari za mwenu sabo Kwega hili na chupa yanga mwebe ni kuchituri Mkama jizibikine Soga la chinde kawa mwenu wo Soga la chinde kawa mwenu wa mwenu Yango go, zaga la chinsi mi na yuwa bwedu, tuale chibi chenge, tuale chibi chaba na bange, tuale chibi chenyumba yange, tuale chibi cheka ni sasebo, tuale chibi chegu anga kwe gairite, tuale chibi cha Afrika kwe gairite, tuale mukwano kwango mwenye chibi, ati hizo kuzi hizo hizo kutoka. Kumangalu wa mudugafu Kumudugafu ya sabi ya mumasa go Mukama sonyi wa sabo Sabo la ukumeno mkubabo Kwega hili te Kwega hili te katonda yizabi nchuyona Kwega hili te Chonda chukuzi hizo sabo Kwega hili te sonyi wa so you want relent, relent, oh God, just a moment. Kuku kuba mukama, kuku sebina bwelo nyingize. Chunga bamba neba chukupu, neba chukupu miamba la miamba wenga te kuliko. Balari ona wadolfu nido. Abala kanga inga tuala. Musai gua Yesu, chamba lo changen chipi se musai gua Yesu. Kama kwe gairi tenze, tunde kanga kwe gairi. Tunze gari rangi bwe rongwe gairi. Omoni ango tego gari bwe anga zingi. Yesu kwe gairi. Tuli na dala munda muti maguange. Ocho zenti sa munda yange. Ocho neke tika yoku muti maguange. Ocho neke tiza sobe nenga mbike nevi yange. Yesu berenga mikono jange Yesu berenga mundo waza zange Yesu julenga muti magu wange Echoche kunonye sa Echoche nyesonga luwachi kunonya Echoche ndesa ye meneze Chindesa ye miyokuli ya nevi okunywa njegalo kwe Njegalo chule munda yange Njegalo chule muti magu wange sebo Njegalo mene muze Jagalo tuli na dala muze Jagalo wanike chigambo cho Kumuti magu wange Chambale ngambula kwa wange Kufu kilo wa mungu kwa mnene kwe netika Budi olu changa siku umuza Wandika Engrave Your law Your decree upon my heart O God Come on Wandika, wandika kutiza kechi gambo choku munti magu wange Ngechi miwe chinse mbelela Mukama, eteka uli uli liku munti magu wange Gano kuli ya kuma, andi ya kuma Echo chinse mbelela Echo chinse mbelela Echo chinse mbelela Echo chinse mbelela Kama umanyi mwe kwetaka Umanyi mwe saga na kusubwa gulonze Umanyi mwe saga na kusigarira Umanyi mwe saga na kukumewa Gulu na kualo Jagala, jagala Mbele kwa mwali kwa mchifuma Jagala mbele kwa mwali Abali no mutima that is after you 
Abali no mutimanga dawuzi. Oguku gondera. Ogwene nyane guchuka. Jekana teke mungkole chikambo cho. Jekana ngeze kwe na mkolele dalo mutu kilipu. Echoche njekala. Echoche nsaba. Echoche nunya. Echoche nunya sebo kwe gailite. Umtima kwange kwa gala kwe. Umtima kwange njekala kumalibwe wakwe. Swayaga macho wandike. Kama teka wako kumtima kwange. Kama wandike kama teka wako kumtima kwange. Nemo kolona. Sinsonga mberachi. Sinsonga kurwa. Sinsonga mwalino mamazi. Ngana teleke chika mbocho mutima kwange. Ngana teleke teka wako kumtima kwange. Echo chache gendo kumpangu za. Chevan kwe gaili na sebo. One yambile nange. One yambile sebo katona izevi tuviona. Oyambe no mchelo yo. Aino mutima kwa yagala kuchuke. Oyambo mchelo yo. Ano nyama soko kuchuke. Tata. Tata nga Dawdi boya kungani na mupuku. Tabali wafala na nyesunga. Na vetu ze. Yambo mwami hoyo Ayakalo kuchuka Omti wangwa kumelenga kuli kukwe Omo wa reminants of the generation Kuli mulembe wabe na wabe wefisi zao Kuli mulembe waba wabe wesigali zao Kama bana Kama bachala Kama bami Kwega hili desebo Baka wana wabe wesigali zao Oni kete kani ukumiti majabwe. Aba na ba vubuka. Teleka. Kete kani ukumiti majabwe. Kwe gairi demu kama. Kwe gairi demu sanga ni muto. Onero nero mnange. No te kete kani ukumiti maguange. Kaba na bobo wala, bote leke teka kumiti majabwe. Kaba na bavu boka, bote leke teka kumiti majabwe. Oba chai se chibi mukama, oba gazi sawu choke ni vungu e gaidi de, oba gazi senge chigambo cho, oba relate ingenga kumula mo bobuja, e gaidi de katonda inzebin tuvi na. Otele kete kari yoku miti majabwe Omera likili zengo lobu tukilivu Ngabali mubi senge viyabwe Omera likili zolo musango Oba juki ze miti majabwe nti chijula mugwe Kwe gaili deje babela yona Ememe zabwa ziwandi kengako Oba gambo kumobu tukilivu bulijo Oba gambe nga bulijo kutambula na uwe Oba gambe nga buli joko lovi gambe vyo butu kilivu Mukama Mukama Oba wajula mwe miti majaba na bange Oso nseke teka lioku miti majaba Oso nseke chugamba joko miti majaba Oba yambe ngo kube kuche kuma Oba yambe ngo kuche kuwa tanga Nti sayo kule mele kumula mubu abwe Nti sayo kule tule kumiti majabwe Nti sabi da bana Nange gwali eyo Teka bana mkono jemu kama Usabi da miti majabwe Jiwani kiwe keteka liya mkama Atene keteka liya kumiti majabwe Kwe gaide katonda inzebi ntuviona Mkama abana vomule mbe guno Bambi nkwe gaide Kwe gaide Tasa abana mkani sasebo Mwandi keteka li wakumiti majabwe Iyo yona jevali mkama Mwandi keteka li wakumiti majabwe Abana wabu wala na wabu lenzi Mkwe gaili desebo Mwumulikala yona 
Mwabuli tribe yona Mwabuli guangali yona Mwuka mangwe gairide Wandi kete kari yoku miti majaba na wafe Wandi kete kari yoku miti majabwe Teleke chika mojo miti majabwe wale moku onona Kwe gairide sebo Kwe gairide Kwe si mwe fisi zewe kani seye nja Kwe fisi zewe wana Kwe fisi zewe wana Lord Engrave your law Engrave your decree Upon their hearts oh God Teleke chika mbocho kumiti majawe Teleke teka liyo kumiti majawe Bane moko nona Bane moko nona sebo Mugambi Tia ni ndagano jodi gala gana nafe Ndagane tali kwa wo Bocho boyo kedemu yene mia Mukama Titu ni baba ntubo Na wali wena katonda wafe Ama na mange Ama na mafe Ama na mkanisa Ama na mkwanga Ama na mwafrika Ama na mkama mweja Ama na mwyora Ama na mwziona Babo Babo sebo Ama taliba kubula babo Baba na mafe babo Teleke chika mbocho kumiti majawe Teleke teka liyo kumiti majawe Teke ntisa yomu meme zawe Teke ntisa yomu nda mu meme zawe Mkwe gairide Buli olucha Buli olucha sabo mkwe gairide Buli olucha mkwe gairide Ngata udi waya kutila sulimadi Na mga manti tovanga katondono Na nge nkwe gairide Kutila wana bafo kuwela babo Kutile guangalino Oba na me guangalino kuwa babo Kwe gairide miti maja wejibe dhe dhe jivyo Mimeza wejibe dhe 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 zizo mkama Ubula mbwa wejibe dhe 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 bubo Boku mune mbegu walulo kuguza joli Banke miti maja wamba mba na bato Eyo mnyumba za wije bali redo Eyo mwaza deba wije bali redo Wambe miti majawe Waya umkame miti majawe Baye miti majawe mikono jo Mbasika yomu kubula Beja yomu la beja wa deba tuwala Mimeza wezi za joli Miti majawe nji za joli mkama Mba wambi la dela kuwa kristo Yesu Bazi mba kecho kumele chobu tukidifu Mama mba kule za kwa mnido kwa gulu Sulo mnido munda za we Bata mbule nkange chikomi Kachibu buka munda za we Na we wana kuote chikamba chimu Bana imili na kwe juo kutusa levali wangula Yesu nkwe gailide Yesu za nkwe gailida Nkwe gailide Nkwe gailide sebo Sede kenti sayo munda miti majawe Newe bali kula te bali kumbako Bala ke kuweli wa wutu kilivu Te bali mula Te bali wabasebo Bali imi nilo kuchusale bali wangula Sinsongo mule mbe mubiche nkanaji Sinsongo e guangali e gari ono nezeritia Oba febabo E kanisa iyo Mukama Oba nabe kanisa babo Kweka hili dekachona inzevi ntubiona Abana babo Abana babo Abana babo Kweka hili de Batambule nganga bafumi tili ze chika mbojo Palo gole le zenga mkwaburi jwe misana na echilo Bateleke chika mbojo miti majabwe Bane mokono na mungeri yona Ente saye kule mele kumiti majabwe Yesu nkweka hili denze Yesu nkusabienze Gwegwe nega hila katonda inzevi ntu yona Eda gwegwe nsabo wa yambe Kama nkwe size Kwe size Kwe size Kwe size Kwa londele alondole mirembe Aba naba isiraidi Kwa yoke danga nabo Mulembe kumulembe 
Go ba juki zabo ba jaja we. Na fara na ba fori ba juki zanga. Kumu nembo kuta kodi ba gambe chigamba chu. Emi nembe chita kodi chigamba ngi chigamba chu. Emi chima jawe tejiri kaka nyala. Jiri bela jijo. Tu kweva zakuanga choli ba deka. Tu kwe chiti ba kuanga tevali waba. Kama chujama sogo. Katunge do kusaba. Tu sabi de mi ti me mi ko. Owo mu kwa na liwa mu na fe. Sawe no imusa. Imusa mi ti me chiri no bolumi. Tatu jinsa kujibu samaso. Muda chika zafesa chuli na yo. We gaidi de. Imusa yo mu ti ma. Ogo kaba. Wakiri oruembera. Oguva de Gukaba, Orena Kunovinike, the Jiba de Tabu de Tabudua, Kamajis Sinkane, Kamatu Jajori, Katumanori Katunda, Alumawa Muna Baluma, Mukamori Katunda, Ojano Sangula Mazigagaba Bakaba, Tujamo Masogo Katunda for Mulunji, Natanga to you must say meet him. Wani emi timejiri yo, gajiri no bulumi, muna ngenga jitabudwa tabudwa. Wani omu chalari yo, wani emu amiari yo, gauli lata manchida ko. Mweno time mukama, abamu ba wuli da, ngoma wani fude ne baba wo, basi singa ne sabo, ingi na mayumba gabantu bo. Osi sinka ne miti meji wade, osi sinka ne miti meji duma. Kwe gai de kato na wangu mulungi, tuba itoko. Abala la justi cha kulia, kwe bulu mi mwe baina. Yingi na mnyumba zawe, yingi na mnyumba zawe. Mukama umo ezo bulu mi mwe, owo nyo bulu mi owo ni mwe. Yingi na mnyumba zawe sabo. Gemi tima jira de jaga la kuvako, olwembe la jaba itamu, gaba ino mulo mi itawali a inza kuvonya, gaba nonya gaba inzo kunyonya lena kuyabwe, kete ba mula ba, abala la kuvendo mu mayom, abala la mukama wange jaba ina yamba, abala la mukama ba nonya mbere, abala la mukama ba kuvendo kumini mu, abala la munda ngeba de kwa wo. Yesu, kwe gai ni desi sinka na bantu mo, kwe gai ni desi sinka na bantu mo, si sinka na bantu mo, si sinka na bantu mo. Nange, sami achi gamba cho. First Chronicles, verse chapter twenty one. Nga, wali mukuba isiraidi, ngoga mbata wudi, tia yono nye. No chani kukuba Na ye Na ye Malaika wayari ya ingira Yerusalemi o kukuba Gasi tude chitala No gamba it is enough Let you say it is enough oh God Kama yoke na tichimalo Yoke na tichimalo mundange Boba wade wawene za malaika kukukukukukuba Olwe chibi chafe mundange Kamba malaika nti chimala leke dao, kama nkuwe gaidi de yoke nti chimala, kuwa yoke na mufas kwa ni kosa ni zina, kuwe gaidi de yoke na, yoke na ni omchala kama nti zina, yoke na ni abana mati nti zina, yoke na ni omami oyati nti zina, yoke na ni oyati nde wali tuala ni zina. Please Lord, please God, please the Father to the fatherless, to please our God. You get up, you get up, teach him all. You get up, that it is enough. You get up, Munange. You get up, you have a sin. Kwe gaidi dem kama, balala teba cha you get up, namu masogo. Bawudi langa cha bawudi la, bawudi langa ya baleka, bawudi langa ya beda bida. But Jehovah, please say that it is enough. Say tonight that it is enough for Jehovah. Speak to us that it is enough. 
Gamedi aba firwa. Gamant it is enough. Gamedi aba koyent it is enough. Oh God. Kama yogeleri guangari ankenti chimala. Yogeleri amawanga goti chimala. Yogeleri omchalo yoti chimala. Yogeleri omano yoti chimala. Kwe gairi ne. Bakari chimala. Basiza chimala mundange. Bavori dua chimala tat. Kwe gairi ne. Yogela, Yogela. Yogela, you have But you get anti mukamate chuli kuvako. But you get anti katonda wafe. Ye katonda tulokote. Mukame miti majawe. Oje zajoli. But we did not cover. But we did Baudi de Subi, Bagay de Catonanga Tajulu, Catonango Mlunjo Mesigua, Kama to Kuechi Tiba to Kugulumiza, to Queba Zakuango de Wachisa, to Kuechi Tiba Kuango de Mulunji, Weba de Gokatonda Tajulu Kuka, Tunasin Zanga Gue, Tunakulumizanga Gue, Tunayim Sanga Gue Misana Nechido. Mukama tu kwebaza, tu kwebaza kubangoli wachisa, tu kwebaza kubangoli mutukuvu. We give you glory and honor. We praise you, Jehovah Jireh. Kama tu kuagala, tu kuagala katonda wa iblemi saka ni yakobo. Mukama tu agade, gwa soko kutu agala, tu agala. Na yena ngenjo gela nti tukwa gala Tukwa gala mkwa nguwa fe Mkama nguwa gala Kwa gala na umtima guwange Kwa gala na magezi gange Chevanja gala ukutambula nga nawe Ngatuli mkubo tunyumia babidi Jagala kusula nga nawe Ngatunyumia chilo mutombi Jagala nkele nga Nganyumia nawe Mukama tu kuagala, tu kuagala oli mukwano guafe, o tu agala, wagamanti wala ba tu asa no kuagali ba, no tu agala no kuagala o kutali guawo, with an everlasting love. Mukama o tu agala, na fe tu kuagala, echiti wane tendo bisigalenga bivio, tu kuwe chiti wa. Give you honor. Kwano weba le kusaba na fe. Tukuwe tuwa katone chitiwa. Rigambo vya fe ni miti maja fe. Tuweba zizanyo katonda kuwanga mulu unji. Ela tuchagenda maso. Naulu kungana. Gwalieyo tukuweba zogobe dida mkama kwenyo mkisa. Aba wagido lukunga na mukama yongedo ba wamuksa era mongedo tavako kuvanga tuchage na maso tuina yuno muere zana tumla la mukama yeba zibu amanya gangenze ya kinjaya gandi mofumbo mukama mweba zakuvanga na ngi yanja gala ati yanja gala no kuagalo kuchali guawo mukama yeba zibu nyo. Ulna kolwa lero tuina yomweleza omlala. Weva lokuvera ngori wamu na fe. O kuvida dala kusawa mukaga. O kutusa kat. Mukama eva zibwe. Mukama eva zibwe. Yes, the Lord. Tuweba za katonda. We thank God. Nti tucha agenda maso. That we are going forward. Tucha ina yo muwele za mchigambo. We still have a preacher that is coming. Edo sigaleko. We request you to stay on. Stay online. Na yiku sawa zino. But at this at this time, to gain the quantity of Julies, 
We are going to welcome the testimonies. There are people that have testimonies. Really, the Lord has worked, He has done something in people's lives. God works, and even in your life, He's working. Even when you're not seeing what He's doing. After some time, you will know that the Lord was really working. Amen. Amen. Let us welcome the person with the testimony. Sister Nabasumba Mukama Kuomksa. Amen. Edabuana Vako. After my sister has finished. Worship team. Ojakubangoja. After she finishes. She would, the worship team will come and take us through the praise and worship. May the Lord richly bless you. Amen. Come, I was away. Come, I was a woman. Never would it is a lava. But I'm face, Christo. Never some come along, so go and Amanya ganga bamita na basumba Oliver Ngani mwana mu kifo kino eno Simba mukamo lo mukisagwa mpadde okuyita musumba wa fe Sefuma Steven ne mama wa fe Feva Sefuma na baweleza bonna musumba fe baweleza nabo abasala we nsonga ze kanise eno mukama abawo mukisa olo mukiso gumpeleddwa ensonga ya mutima Nango vujuri zivenzo kuwabu wa mutima Nalime nyeseko mutima Wenaji na mchifo chineno na jatu sauzo and seventeen Nga nati loku guwako Ovaka wena sanga kumusumba wali avu ulida Bwali buogira kubika Ede njiji na sanga wo na ulida anga Nduza antuse mchika E kanisa yange ya soka Ye ya soka iladana na limuto Nozanga 16 years. Ne kanisa yangi jina soke la mu. Omusu mboyo. Sigenda muoge la linya. Ne kanisa sigenda joge la linya. Na ye na menye kila yomu tima. Kuwanga china lindo woza. Siche nalaba. Siche nalaba. Siche, siche na feeling. Anga wena linchilo woza. Ne nebaza mukama. Anti wenaja mchifo chino. Ore njiri evu ulirua. Omusumba fenaba wede zabo na mubitiebi enja ulovyo nabi watu tu sako. Omutima guwangu genze guwonye zewa. Elanga guzi imbivwa. Thank God that the time I've spent here, my pastors and the different ministers that have ministered in my life, my heart has really been mended. Namenye kanti omutima. How was my heart broken? Mubisele we nafuno uruwade. By that time I was sick. And I reached a point of being operated. And they operated me. In my age. In my spiritual infancy and physical infancy. I thought people would come and pamper me around and be with me and Care so so much about me. Nadale kanisa kuma mama ngi tali mulo kole elanga subira ke yokuva mukanisa. Especially from the church because my mother was not born again, so I expected a lot of love from the church. Na yo musumba ngi yoge la wati. But my pastor said like this. Simusumba se mfuma. Not bishop se. Ikanisa ya soka. But my first church. Yagamba wa kuwa ngi yoge buzewa li muruvu tu era banongo sa muruvu tu. Because the problem was in the stomach, so they operated me. Yagamba and ah. So he said that uh, that one just aborted. So that is why she has gotten that problem. Uh, girls are like that. All that is just conniving. That word hurt me so much. That word broke my heart. He spoke those words when he was on the pulpit in the church. 
Over katinga mazo wana zile kanisa angabanda wabulala when I, after, after I, had, I was healed, when I went back to church, people would look at me in a weird way. In that church, we had a lot of problems. But because the leader was the one to quench the fire that was going on in church, but he was, in, 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 but he was yet the trouble causer. But when I came in this place They taught us about the inner man They have told us many topics I had closed up my heart Especially towards pastors and ministers Provided you have any title My heart had closed I could not draw close to them So I would come to church just to listen to the word and then I would go. Even when you would when I had a problem and you tell me that go to the church, to the pastor, I could not go. Even when you are a youth leader and you tell me to go to another leader to tell to share my problem, I would not. But I thank God now that I can even go to my pastor just to greet him. I can talk to my leaders I thank God so much for the word that is preached in this place So in case anything that comes and it wants to, 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 to hurt my heart The word that is preached in this place Not only our bishop but also other ministers around the word has really built a wall around my heart. And I remember in 2017 in the Inner Man Conference. I remember the word that Mami Fever Senfuma preached. She gave us a word in Isaiah 50, 51 verse 1. That we should look at Christ, the, the rock from which we are hewn. And she used an example of a cake that was to, to show the rock. And she cut a piece of that cake. And she showed us that we, we are all cut from that rock. We are all cut from Jesus, the rock of ages. And she told us that we, we all ought to go back and fit where we were cut. And that when we come when we are in the world we, we get many things that make us so big that when you put us back to the place where we are, we are cut we can't fit that word touched me so much and it it edified my heart that I had to work upon my heart such that I could fit where I was cut. I thank God that right now my heart is very fine. I thank God for everything that he planned for me, the plans he has upon my life and the main things he has done. May God bless you. Kama kwenye mkisa mkwana Akusanyi se Banango ujuri zobo tu kubile muka mengale za amanyi Bobango uliku mkutu Nebobo tulaba Nebobo uliriza kredio Manyinga nawe muka makoze mbulambo Nawe ino ujuri zi Ila tuweba ze katonda Katuwa nize worship team Etutuwale maso muka mabawinyo mkisa Hallelujah Yes. Yes. 
era yeka yefanana yeka mu byona byakola yesonga laji tumutendereza kumachana simye cha wandike wanga chega amanti teri chitu kisanyu sa mwana wa muntu ngo kulya no kunywa no kola byayagala mhm na yebyo na mboka tunda ya muyamba kubikola wabata mu bidita sobala kulya ono kubado kunywa katugenda gulumizo yonga tumuwe tendo kubanga ye katonda wa fe Hey. Afana na Yesu taliyo Afana na Yesu simula wanga Nonyeza, nonyeza sina muzula Afana na Yesu taliyo Afana na Yesu taliyo Afana na Yesu simula wanga Nonyeza, nonyeza sina muzula Afana na Yesu taliyo Afana na Yesu taliyo Afana na Yesu simula banga Nonyeza nonyeza sina muzula Afana na Yesu taliyo Afana na Yesu taliyo Afana na Yesu simula banga Nonyeza nonyeza sina muzula Afana na Yesu taliyo Akabobula mu Ye Yesu wa fe Yali nobu yiza Ye Yesu wange Nonyeza nonyeza sina muzula Afana na Yesu taliyo Afana na Yesu taliyo Afana na Yesu simula banga Nonyeza nonyeza sina muzula Afana na Yesu taliyo Ya tukumye obuta lwala Ya tuanguziza hivi zibu biona Nonyeza nonyeza sina muzula Afana na Yesu taliyo Afana na Yesu taliyo Afana na Yesu simula banga Nonyeza nonyeza sina muzula Afana na Yesu taliyo Ya gawobulamu ye Yesu wange Hampa demirembe leka mojimu se Nonyeza nonyeza sina muzula Afana na Yesu taliyo Afana na Yesu taliyo Afana na Yesu simula wanga Nonyeza nonyeza sina muzula Afana na Yesu taliyo 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 Afana na Afana na Nonyeza nonyeza sina muzula Afana na Yesu taliyo 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 Afana na Afana na Nonyeza nonyeza sina muzula Afana na Yesu taliyo 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 Afana na Afana na Nonyeza nonyeza sina muzula Afana na Yesu taliyo Kupine nga loko muyesu Nga 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 Yelele mama Yansingi ebi luji Ye muka mayinsonga lwa chinange Muhimu soyo Yansingi ebi luji Ye muka mayinsonga lwa chinange Muwe chitiwa Singile bilonji Ye muka mayinsonga lwa chinange Muwe chitiwa Singile bilonji Ye muka mayinsonga lwa chinange Muwe chitiwa Ye mulu kendo luange Ye muka mayinsonga lwa chinange Muwe chitiwa Singile bilonji Ye mu 
kama ilisonga rachinange Mwe chitiwa Mwe utalwala Mwe kama ilisonga rachinange Mwe chitiwa Masingire bilunji Mwe kama ilisonga rachinange Mwe chitiwa Masingane mchana wangere Muwechitiwa Mukama yesonga rachinange Muwechitiwa Mwandide talo zange Mwana wangula yesonga rachinange Muwechitiwa Masingire biruji Mukama yesonga rachinange Muwechitiwa 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 Muwechitiwa
Hallelujah, we give you praise. There is none like you, King of Glory. Surely you're the best surgeon that I know. Surely you're the best heart surgeon that I know. It is only you that we give praise, Almighty Savior. O Sani de Mukama, Tukuwe Chitiwa, Tukuwa Matendo, Imu Sedo Bozidia, our Wali Tumusinze. Tumwe chitiwa kuru wa msalaba Kubanga ye wayo kuru wa fe Ye wayo kuru wa fe Mganda wange negatako Tumusinze, tumusinze, tumwe chitiwa Oya tude kuna mulono Tumwe chitiwa Kusani de Yesu Kwe ya yuwa ulamu nzembero ulamu Kwa wayo ulamu bo Zekuno ulamu Kusani de tata Kusani de Yesu Kwe vale mokama Kwe vale Yesu Kumusalaba 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 Wewa ya kuluange Ukufa Wali kuntu tolwe bibi Yange na ye Kumusalaba Jewa fira jewa kwera 
like a river that has overflowed just like a river that has overflowed father come and feel our hearts once more like a river that has overflowed like a river like a river We love you. We worship you, King of Glory. Like a river, may you fill us once again. That may overflow. Lord, help us guard our hearts once again. This evening, as we listen from your word, let your presence overtake us. Holy Spirit, we surrender. We are ready to be taken by you. Lead us through. We shall listen and follow. In Jesus' name. Ladies and gentlemen, let us give the Lord a hand of praise wherever you are. Praise and worship team, thank you so much. May God bless you really. It is an honor once again to share in the word and to be live, I would say, in the world. I want to welcome our friends on Facebook and our friends on YouTube our friends following us on Inaman Radio on all platforms on radio Alcasta Radio App and um, Radio Wave Radio Radio Casta, Radio App and Radio Wave my name is Conrad Sande. My interpreter, would the world would like to know your name as well? And we are so privileged to minister this evening. I want to appreciate the leadership of our church, UCC, United Christian Center Church. Um, or being headed by our beloved Bishop Stephen Senfuma. And the entire pastoral team who saw it wise being led by the Holy Spirit to have this conference happen at such a time like this. We love you and we thank you for planning and putting everything possible as well. And the entire team who are working day and night to make sure the conference happens. You may see us here, but there is a big team behind this to allow you to see this image you are seeing. These gentlemen, I say, may God bless them for they live a sacrificial life to see that the souls 
are blessed. Abasajja bano twagala okugamba nti katonda kaba wo omukisa kubanga be wayo okulaba nge memeza mwe ziwe bo omukisa. I want to appreciate all our viewers and listeners for paying the price to watch this conference. Some of you have to buy internet bundles. Others have to borrow gadgets that can enable you watch. Yet others have to tune in the radio. And all is done to make sure that you do not miss the conference. Our friends all over the world, we may not mention the country you are watching us from. But wherever you are tapping us from, may God really bless you. Should we come to know that you are not there, I assure you we shall not also be here. But by the mere fact that you are there, we are also here to see that you are blessed in Jesus name well our topic is guard your heart once again I, to, I think I told you my name my name is Conan Sanda I, I always forget to introduce myself whenever I speak to people so I sometimes introduce myself more than once to make sure I do not forget it again I'm married God has blessed us with children. One of them threw away my ring. Asked him where is the ring. He told me also doesn't know where he put it. it was a so uh, sometimes you see a married man without a ring and a lake. Is it a new gospel for a guy not to come with a man? No, it's not. It was misplaced, but I'll put it on. Don't worry. You know, we try to put everything right. There are so many gospels around the world. Well, our Proverbs 4, 23. I know most pastors have talked about this. But we shall talk about it anyway. And we shall continue talking about it. Guard your heart. I will read it. 4.23 Proverbs. My translation says, Watch over your heart with all diligence. For from it flow the springs of life. From it flow the springs of life. I've tried to summarize this sermon today and I know we shall share with you. And I think the people in technical team, you can always share it and we move together. Since you're at home, you may not make the notes. I'm trying to summarize some few things. Those on Facebook and on YouTube, you are going to find it before the comments start. I try to put it on PDF in case it doesn't open, let us know so that we can send you maybe a word copy. Then our friend on WhatsApp, you will receive it shortly after the sermon. But I know you will have it anyway. But the summary, some few things may not be there and we may speak about it. We are going to put for you a picture. I try to put up a picture that shows someone who is okay, a guarded heart, in other words. I don't know whether you, for those of you who are viewing, you will be able to download it. And I believe our technical team is going to put it there shortly. That gentleman, or that head, Okay, that thing has. It is not. It is not a new teaching. But I'm trying to put these things from theory to practical. I 
and a picture of your heart inside it. I'm trying to bring down the theme or the emphasis of God, your heart. That is, I'm trying to show you a guarded heart. Now, physically, you will not find your heart and get a babudua and you guard it. But I'm trying to give you an, a scenario of a guarded heart. I'm to give you a scenario of a guarded heart. Then shortly you are going to see a heart which is guarded and is, there is a river flowing. I pray you put it there as well so that when we begin explaining some of your things you will have the, you will have the, uh, the image or the visual part of it then we can be able to comprehend. Now what I was meaning there is part B of Proverbs chapter 4 verses 23. For from it flow the springs of life. I was trying to show you water flowing from the heart. Now that heart is full. And it is guarded. The assumption here is the water flowing from the heart is a pure water. And is ready to be used for any good purpose. And it is what Jesus told us in Matthew chapter 12 and verses 34. I will paraphrase it the end of the, 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 the some part of it where it says, from the abundance of the heart, the mouth speaks. Uh, 12 34 Matthew. Matayo kumina bida satu munya nga yesa gamba anti e chujulo mutima aka mwache kogera. Because now if you, okay let me read there so that I do not over paraphrase. 12.34 Matthew, you brood of vipers, uh, Christ was answering. How can you being evil speak what is good? You brood of vipers, how can you being evil speak what is good? Mwabana be misota. For the mouth speaks out of that which fills the heart. The same thing in Luke 6, uh, 45. I'm assuming the heart is full. And it is full with the good things. Jesus is reputing the statement. Yes, so statement. He's saying, You brood of vipers. How can you, being evil, how can you, being evil, Speak what is good. Implying that from the abundance of the heart. <laughs> the mouth speaks. When you read Proverbs 10, 11, Let's go there slowly. Proverbs chapter 10 and verses 11. The mouth of the righteous is a fountain of life. I just like that portion of scripture. The mouth of the righteous is a fountain of life. But the mouth of the wicked conceals violence. Now, if you are Guarded, if your heart is well guarded, your heart will be filled with good things. I would call it good, be, being accepted by God. And from the good things, when you begin to speak, you will speak of the good things. 
Now, when you read Proverbs 21 and verses 2, Katibo Somengera Abiri Mwe Muno Rinyoro Kubiri, 21 verses 2. Every man's way is right in his own eyes. But the Lord weighs the heart. Every man's way is right in his own. He sees everything fine. But whatever we do, whatever we say, whatever we see, whatever we think, whatever the the Lord will come and weigh the heart. Put on that third image that shows you how the heart feeds and how the heart also releases out. As an individual, you will not be able to speak good when you've entered evil. Now, you, according to those following us on WhatsApp, Facebook, and uh, maybe the internet, you can, you can what you see feeds the heart. What you say feeds the heart. What you do feeds the heart. Your heart gets filled up with whatever sources. At one time, Bishop showed us an image of an antenna that was feeding the, the heart. And from that antenna, you will get the waves around the world and you appreciate what to feed your heart with. From the the fullness of the heart then will come out through your mouth. Will come out through your deeds. Will come out through the action. So that the Bible will be true when it says God will judge every evil word that proceeds out of your mouth. Bible, our meaning, our meaning in a man conference, online in a man conference this time. We chose this portion of scripture, Proverbs 4:23. We chose this verse in particular because we recognize that the religion just taught was about sincere heart transformation. When you follow through Matthew 15 verses 8 and 9, you are going to find that heart transformation is the key that we ought to deal with. Uh, Matthew 15 verses 8 These people honor me with their lips but their hearts are far away from me but in vain they do worship me teaching as doctrines the precepts of men Coming closer, we come closer to God. But our hearts are far away from him. One of our objectives of having this theme of scripture is to draw men's heart closer to the maker. It is my prayer that as I speak this to you, I speak it to myself more than I speak it to you. It is a great concern of all people in all areas of life. As parents, sometimes we focus on behavior change of children. And sometimes we look at their, what they've done. And we reprimand them, we discipline them, expecting them to do the right thing. Little do we pay attention to the driving force 
towards their behavior. They may show transformation on their actions today when in their hearts they are rotting. Is our prayer is our concern that we draw men's hearts to God. Today, we may speak good. We may act good. We may religiously appear good. But we may not be right with God. What do we allow into our hearts? We may try to force ourselves to control what we speak. But what is filled inside of us? One time Christ made a very radical statement. The Pharisees had come closer to him and they were very righteous in their own actions. He gave a scenario. Jesus said, I know you are the teacher of the law. You are the teacher of the law. Outside is clear. But it's full of rotten bones. When you have a cup. And you wash it outside when it is very clean. And the inside has never been tampered with. It's very dirty. I assure you that cup is very dirty. Dirty. My dressing code may not show the state of my heart. I may appear good before men. You may look wonderful before whoever sees you around. But the question comes. He who inspects the heart. When it comes to your heart. What will he see? For the heart is deceitful above all things. Jeremiah 79 says so. Because you can fool yourself and you think you're righteous. You do the actions that seem to be fine. You speak the words that are well calculated. But when the heart is rotting. The the biblical concept of guarding your heart means an honest understanding that God is greater than our hearts. The biblical concept of guarding our heart means an honest understanding that God is greater than our hearts. The biblical concept of guarding our heart means an honest understanding that God is to turn hearts of men to God. To bring to understanding that one ought to guard his or our own heart. Whereas we discipline children. We impart in them biblical principles. To know God on their own. To know the value of God on their own. To know their value on their own. So that whatever they do. They can account for it. For this reason. We started schools to train little ones to guard their hearts at their tender age. We have two primary schools that's Inaman Primary School, uh, Kasubi, and Inaman Primary School, Zengebe. And we are doing all things to train children to understand God on their own. We do not urge, we do not go contrary to the, to the national syllabus. 
On the syllabus, Ku syllabus we add on Christianity. We add on godliness. And we break it down to their level from nursery up to upper primary. Ate, ne tubi menya menya ne tubi teka buli omu kudara de liari koko kuvira dala ku nasa lo kutoka kupi seven. We are intentional to make children know God. E chilo bidu racha fechiri nti tulu bidu da nyo okule teraba no kutege la katonda. Our bishop Stephen Sainfuma started a secondary school, Steva Christian High School, to train children to guard their heart and know God at their own tender age. Omo sumba wa Stephen Sainfuma ya tandi kesomero ya secondary Steva Christian High School, nga ya gala atende kabana o kume mitima jabu no kutege la katonda kumiaka jabu emito. In fact, if you have children, these are very good places to train your children. Okay, that's just, that's just a by the way. Why do you need to guard your heart besides? One, your heart is highly valuable and on market. Tegera ante omutima go gwa beyi nyo ate guli kukatale nyo. You heart is on market. Omutima go guli kukatale. The devil wants to snatch it away from God. Sitana ya gala gusiko guja kukatonda. And God wants it because he's the author, he's the creator. Atenga ne katonda gweta aga kubanga ya gukula. It is your decision whom are you giving your heart. Kati kusala woko gwe ani go guwa. But no your heart is on market. Na yete gera ante omutima go guli kukatale. It is extremely valuable. Gwa beyi. Beyi nyo kwa mwendo. You can never monetize it. Tosho bola guwa nisa musente. And you can never exchange it for anything. Ela tosho bola guwa nisa muchi ntuchila la chuna. Apart from giving it back to the maker. Okuja koku guwa obuwe ya gukola. Or to give it back to the enemy. Obano guwa sitani. Therefore. No rwecho. Guard your heart. Kumo mutima go. We've seen banks. Tulabye banksi. Where there are so many guards with the different weapons. We tulaba bakumia benja ulonga baku tebio kuruwa nisebio njaulu. Because there is a value. There are valuable items in that bank. Kubanga mulimuwe bintuwebio muwendo mutele kerori ya sente. There could be homes. Wainzo kubawa wa maka. That are highly guarded. Ngaga kumi wanyo. It means there are valuable things in that home. It could be a state house. There are so many arm officials. In different ranks. With different fighting tactics. With different guarding mechanisms. On guard 24 hours, 7 days a week. Natural week number. They are valuable national and international things in the state house. What you have been to have your window, have your guanga, have your mawanga, malala, have your mumaka. Enemies would want to steal them. Abala be bandi agado kubiba. But the guards on their own tension, day and night, on duty, they are guarding the state house. Na ya bakumi, na boba kumi, na kubu nkenke misana nechiro, nga bakuma state house. Banks are on guard day and night. Matero kero gasente, gabe la mubu kumi ya misana nechiro. Why don't you guard your heart? Gweru wachito kuma mutima go. It is highly valuable. I don't have what to explain this. Siri nabi gambo vimala kunyo nyo lanto mutima go, wabeyi nyo. When one young man was attacked by evil spirits, by the same, then he was cutting himself with stones and he was in the graveyard. Then Christ was passing by and looked at him and he had pit on him. Then the evil spirit shouted and said, What do you want from us? Our time is not yet ready. Christ asked, Who are you? Christo na abuza, ye guani. They shouted, we are a legion. Neba uganaanga waga amba feri joni. Christ will look down and I'm like, Christo na atunula na agamba banai. This man was like this for a very long time. Omo sajo no yalibu hati okumale miyaka minji. The Bible says there were herds of pigs nearby. Bible ya gamanti wali wawe chisibo chembizi. Christ commanded the evil spirits to leave the man. Christo, nala gire mizimu jive mumuntu, elane jingira mumbizi. The Bible says, Bible ye gamba, there were around 2,000 pigs, am I right? There were around 2,000 pigs? 200. 200, 200, 2,000. Okay, we'll research about it. There were around 2,000 pigs. Mbizi zari yao mungkumi bili. Now, 
Whether 200 or 2,000. I am a farmer. You look at the value of those herds of pigs. And the value of a mad man. And Christ did not spare the pigs. He ordered the evil spirits to enter the pigs. This is the first time pigs forgot that they don't know how to swim. All of them entered water. Zona zaduka ziingira mumazi. The Bible said they were they drowned. Bible yegamba zagua mumazi. The farmer, the owner of pigs. Nani nimbize yali azirunda? I presume he mobilized the community. Ntebere zanti obori yao yakuunga e chalo chona. And I assume Christ was given another name. A loss making man has come our our village. Because the whole farm has entered in water. How much investment was that? Now those investments. Norwecho investments ingezo. Which were more valuable to the owner of the farm was very less valuable compared to the heart of the madman. My point here is your heart is very, very valuable. You can't exchange it with anything. Therefore, guard it. Your heart is the source of everything you do. When you choose to decide and do something, it comes from your heart. And you do it wholeheartedly, like we always say. For this reason, since it is the source, guard it. So that your actions are guarded. Your words are controlled. Your eyes are controlled. So that you can be able to manage the expectation of the maker. Your heart is under constant attacks. Why? It is on market. Of recent, we heard of a bank being robbed. Why was it robbed? Maybe the guards were not on guard. Maybe the robbers overpowered the guards. You as the owner of the heart, how are you guarding your heart? When you begin to speak, what proceeds out of your mouth? Because from the abundance of the heart, the mouth will speak. Ladies and gentlemen, it's not one, it's not one day's work. Not two days' work. You will not come and say, yes, now me, I have guarded my heart. I've even thrown away the keys. Guarding your heart is a daily activity. Even as we speak like this, hearts are under constant attack. And when they are the cracks are created. Then you begin to enter in all the chaff, all the wrong things, all the wicked things, and you, got, you keep them inside the heart. Yeah. Then you mix up Christianity, you mix up the world, and you find when the things have extended their position, the worldliness is in the heart, and the Christian is speaking the world, the Bible. You wonder what is it exactly is trying to mean. Then you become arrogant. At one time, I was in my place with my brother. 
Omulundi ogumu naliko mwange ne muganda wange. My follower we we were almost we we were almost the same size though different age though then we had misunderstanding as brothers. Oyanzira ko twenkana chenkana size ye mulu akube myaka jawo kana mo kati netubako no butakanya nga abo luganda. Now uh, by that time I was already a minister at church. Mukasera ko nali muwereza mukanisa. A neighbors know I'm a minister. Atengera balira no abange bachimanyi ndi muwereza. So I need to speak like a minister or to speak kati neta gokogera ngo muweleza watekedwa okogera but my brother has annoyed me properly nayenga ate muganda wange anyizize ebyensusu he had little abused me yali amvumye and i also had very good words to abuse that i had also molded and i wanted to make sure that my words are heavier than his atenange nalinkunganyiza ye bigambo byange ngambi gunjuza bulunji atenga njagala nkaka sent bizito okusinga ebibye sometime i'm slow to speak most when i get angered ebisere bimu ndwawo okogera na dalabwe mbanyize my tongue becomes a little heavy that's why i cry a lot olulimi rwange rutero okuzito wamu chemvanka wamuko then i wanted to utter some statements and make sure and show him that you know i think i could do it better than he did kati nali njagala njogere yoke bigambo nange mulagenti nandi chikoze nokusinga gobo wachikoze when i opened my mouth to speak when nagula waka mwaka ngenjogere i don't know what transpired simanyi cha tukawo but something held my mouth ne waliwe cha kwa to mu mwagwa there was a deep sound in my heart telling me don't make permanent statements on temporary situations ne waliyo kawaba yo kulekana mu mutima gwange nga kungamba tokola ebigambe ebyenkala kalira ku mbere ezitaliza nkala kalira but also, i'm like can't you see what is happening this guy is under looking me and and i wanted to make sure i bring him down nenga nange ngamba gwitula bachintu seko omwana ona mpisiza mu amaso nga nange njagala nkakase timuleta wansi but the voice was clear nange doboze ateri wulirikika bulunji do not make permanent statements on temporary situation toyogera bigambo byankala kalira ku mbere ezitali I cried the more. Because I did not do what I wanted to do. Many times I've had misunderstanding with my wife. She's the mother of my children. She's my friend. And I tell her she's my mother. And some words sometimes she disappoints me and I feel I want to bring out one word like this that can make sure that can make her know that she's a wife ne waliwo mu byakola mazima ne mpuliranga nji yeye nyo ne njagala mfurumye ye chigambe chi chimuletero okutegera anti ye mukazi then i most times i struggle myself and i'm like mm -hmm. the word is a fool i know but i'm like mm. and i try but inside of me i'm boiling than never before na yebisere bisinga ngeza ko kwetu gane ntugira ye bigambe byo munda muli munda ne mpuliranga antokota Nene sisobola kubyogera nene fuga My heart is full of evil Omutima gwange gujuddo bubi My mouth may control to speak Akamwaka nge kanyizo kwefuga okogera But the way my heart can boil Naye ngeri omutima gwange je gutokota Let a gentleman should do good one time put up a screen and our heart thoughts are displayed I think I can faint Basebo ne banyabo singo lumuka tonda teka wo rutimbe na yanjuluze biri mu mitima ja fene mundo woza za fena abiteka yo nze nzirika Sometime you come home olumo je waka you expect things to be done the way you expect no lo was ante bintu byakoledwa nga bo byagala remember you've not communicated sometimes jukiro olumo bate wabagambye then you find things have been done otherwise kata teno sanga nga bintu byakoledwa chifula nenge it's been a long day ngateru nakuruba de ruwanvu physically tired nga mu mubiri okoye mentally tired ne mu bwongo ngo okoye spiritually stricken mu moyo ngo kubidwa but with a good physical appearance minister of god naye nga ate kungulo olabika bulunji anti omuweleza wakatonda then you begin to boil inside of you i will not and ko kutokota munda yo to keep in to keep in conformity with the physical appearance you choose to keep quiet okusobola okufana nange ndabike yo kunguru osalawo okusirika but in silence naye nga mu busirisebwo oh hey. god ladies and gentlemen let us guard our hearts leka tukume mitima jafe
Let us guard our thoughts. Let us guard our actions. Let us guard our deeds. Because they are all engineered by whatever fills the heart. I don't know the state of your heart. There are hearts which are stony. Their hearts are desperately wicked. There are so many states of the heart. I don't know which, in which state your heart is this evening. Jeremiah said, how long will wickedness loth within you? For how long will you continue to harbor sins? In your heart. Sometimes we've paid the rent even for the sins in our hearts. We've paid the rent because they, they rent a place in our heart. And you keep it there today, tomorrow, this year, next year, and, and, the, and Jeremiah is saying, for how long? Okay, let us give it time. For how long then? In, in, in Psalms uh, 50, 51 verses 19, the contrite spirit is what the Lord wants. He, 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 he does not desire sacrifice. Or else would have requested for it. Uh, 51.17 The sacrifice of God a broken spirit. A broken and a contrite heart. Oh God, you will not despise. This is what the Lord requires of us. And this is the daily work. Contrite spirit. Contrite. The sacrifice of God are a broken spirit, a broken and a contrite heart. Oh God, you will not despise. Sadaka za katonda ye meme menyese, omutima ogumenyese rogubonere de ay katonda toguga yenga. Ladies and gentlemen, it is a big task. But it's not your work to do the bigger part of it. Our biggest part is to surrender. When you choose to surrender, the one you surrender to will give you the strength to do it more. I pray you understand me here. When you surrender to God, God will give you the strength to overcome whatever has been overcoming you. I revisit again. When you give your heart to God, God is ready to send you help to guard your heart. On the other hand, when you give your heart to the enemy, the enemy is ready to give you strength to be more wicked. I don't know whether this makes sense to you. But the one you give yourself to becomes your master. When he becomes your master, he is in the control of you. Can take you wherever he wants. For this reason, when a born again backslides, he becomes worse than the heathen. Because the wicked spirit come and lodge within him. And whatever used to be wicked and sin becomes normal. I call upon you ladies and gentlemen who are watching us wherever we are It is not too late We can make a U-turn And tell God I have come
If you feel you're on right line with God, stay right there. But if you feel you had gone astray, he is ready to receive us as children. Okay, how do we guard our hearts? There are so many schools of thought. Let me show you my school of thought. How do we guard our hearts? We can, we can guard our hearts and minds through the knowledge of God's word. You cannot guard your heart. Being the heart is wicked and deceitful. To be able to stand on your ground. You should have a backup. Which backup? is the knowledge of the word of God. That's why Joshua was encouraged, do not let this book of the law depart from your mouth day and night. Day and night meditate upon it. For it is life unto your soul. For it is life unto your soul. Oh Lord, give me the grace to read the word. Mukama ampechi sa okusome chigambo cho. You need it. Ochetaga. When your heart is guarded, omutima gwe gubanga gukumidwa, you must have the backup of the word. Oteke do kubera yo nobu yambi obwe chigambo. Because the, ev the enemy will continue visiting you, visiting you. Kubango mulaba agenda kusigala kuchalira, nga kuchalira. When the enemy tempted Jesus, o mulabe boyakema yesu, he came with a word. Yajira mchigambo. It is written. Chawa andi ikiwa. Jesus did not say fire. Yesu te agambo muliro kutole. Though he could call fire. Ne wankuba denga yandi sobo do guita. Jesus did not say I bind you. Yesu te agamba mkusiba. Though he could bind. Ne wankuba dea lia ino uyinzo kumusiba. He did not say I cast you. Though he could curse. But he told the tempter. It is written. Today when we are tempted. We call fire. And tomorrow we find the same thing. And we call fire. There is a contradiction here. Either the fire is not hot. Or the caller has no fire. And either is calling fire in the wrong place. Ladies and gentlemen. The knowledge of the word will guard us against any kind of temptation. I will not give you the formula. Like the prayers are in religion. Because the way you are going to be tempted today. Is different from how you will be tempted tomorrow. But when your heart has the word. You will have the approach. When you begin quoting it. It is. Is written. The Bible says. Then you will be able to stand on your God. Therefore. Guard your heart. And let the word of God be our daily bread. Sold food is for the, for the mature. Who by constant use have trained themselves to distinguish good from evil. Paul says in Romans 16:19. That God wants us to be wise about what is good. And innocent about what is evil. Therefore, you can't be able to discern the good and the evil in something until you've known the standard which you follow. If you do not have the standard you follow, you will follow any standard. And some of the standards will be for the enemy. Therefore, I say, let us give intentionally ourselves to the reading of the word. 
Leka tuwewe yo no kunyikira no kumalirira elio kusoma kwe chigambo And their question comes Elawe chibuze ne chidja Did you read any word of the Bible today? Oro alero kufawe buwa kerede Waso miyo kukuru nyiriri mubaibuli Like we give ourselves to breakfast, to lunch, evening tea, fruits in the middle there, then supper have you given yourself your spiritual life the menu of today nga mugulamu bafobo mubiri bwe tuli echencha ne tuli echemisana ne tuli awawe bibala no lye chaka wungeze kisala budde ekegulo kakati mugulamu obo moyo olina chewe wadde yo ko kulya olwalero we do not need a comprehensive understanding of the kingdom of darkness tetwetaga okumanya okunji to be able to defeat the forces of darkness. Rather, we need to be wise about God and His ways. And lead lives that are informed. Guided. Empowered. By the word of God. And His Spirit. But how will you understand the operation of the Holy Spirit? Until you've consumed the, 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 the user's money. Amen. Amen. So one way uh, we can guard our hearts. I've summarized this. I think they've shared with you those who are on, on social media. One way we can guard our heart is by the through the knowledge of God's word. Nolwe chengeri ya mje tusobo lo kukume miti majafe kwe kujita mukumanya okwe chigambo cha katonda. I've heard uh, some preachers are a little okay. Some people are fun. I will not call them preachers also. Abantaba muba angeri. Sija kubayi tababu ulizi. And even the so-called Christ, some Christians are also funny. Choka atela na abamu kubayi tababu krista yo naboba angeri. Some people have problems. They need help and counseling and guidance. Abamu ba ine bizibu beta go kuyambi bua beta go kurunga mizibua beta go kubulirida. Sometimes some so-called self-imposed preachers do funny things to the believers. Na yebi sere bimu, ababe yita ababu ulizi, abe teka wo, bako levi ntu ebi engeri eri abantu abu. And even the people who such things are done to, choka tena ababantu, bebi kolebu wako, they accept it the way they are because they are not backed up by the word. Babi kiriza nga webiri, ruwa chikuba anga, teba ina yobu ya ambibu wa magezi, mchigambo cha katonda. One pastor told the congregation to drink the anointing oil. Omusumbamu ya gambe chivina, banywa mafuta. To, to guard themselves against the evil spirits. Others, another one told the uh, sometime told the congregation to eat, to lick the soil from his church. And the, some Christians obeyed and they licked this. Other parts, some other so-called ministers demanded to anoint females' private parts. Chokate ababuli za balala. Bo neba, neba, neba lagira. Bafuka mafuta kubitunde biebi ya mebi ya bachara. And whatever ended was long, their long stories. Na yebi ya va muebio. Tebi nza kuogere kika. Kubanga bi wanvu. Why do such people accept such acts on them? Na yeru achaba antu webatio. Bandi kirize biko luangebio kubo. Too shallow in the word. Bampi nyo, bafunda nyo, mchigambo cha katonda. Therefore, no let us eat the word. Deka tulie chigambo. And guard our hearts. Two, we can guard our hearts and minds through holy and consecrated living. Tusobolo kume miti majafe, okuyita mkubero haba tukufu naba antu haba udwa. As well as vicious thoughts, we also need to live vicious lives. As representatives of Jesus and his kingdom, we need to set high standards. For ourselves regarding faith, regarding love, regarding holiness, we need to set a high standard. As our standard is Christ himself. Not comparing ourselves to any man. But Christ be our standard. 
Seven of Paul's letters, he urged the believers to live their lives in a manner worth of the gospel. Era tu ya kula banga Paulo kuita mubalua zee ya budi ranga ba kiriza ba bere mubulamu obuguani de injiri. Today we seem to have lost appetite for holy life. Olale tu la bikatwa bulwa appetite yobula mubtu kuvu. We've lost appetite for Christ being our standard. Ketu cha yaga la nyoka Krista bere echipi mo chafu. We compare ourselves with our leaders. Tregera gera nyana ba tu kulembera. And we seemingly doing better than them. Atengo lumu tu la bikanga ba kolobrunjo kubasinga. We are wrong in that approach. Na yenga no mungeli yeyo tuliba cham. Those leaders of ours we we sometimes compare our lives to are not God. They have their limitations as human beings. What does the Bible say about what you are doing? What is your life portraying in the community where you are? We need to set a standard. God calls us to nothing less than holiness. We need to be holy. He who called us is holy. Anyway, this is another long conference sermon. When we begin talking about holiness, we need time to understand. But in nutshell, be ye holy. For he who has called you is holy. Just first get it like that. Now, uh, for those of you who shared this on you, that's why I'm trying to summarize. Uh, number three, we can guard our hearts and minds through prayer and noble thoughts. We, Bible tells us that whatever is true, whatever is noble, whatever is right, whatever is pure, whatever is lovely, whatever is admirable, think about those things. Bible yeti gamba, buli yeti tukufu, buli yeti runji, buli yeti gwani de, buli yeti tukiri de. Ebi ntungebio bilo oze nga ko. Philippians 4.8, you think about such noble important things. Aba Filipi nyamu nana, lo oze nga kubintwe bilo gwani de. If we are constantly desiring worldly things. Wetuba nga buli jotu ya ya nila bintu biansi. And thinking worldly thoughts. That don't include God. We are letting our God down. Instead we should follow Paul's advice. Set your heart up on things above. Where Christ is seated. At the right hand of God. Set your minds on things above. Not on worldly things. That's Colossians chapter 3 verses 1 and 2. Then I pose a question. What have you set your minds on? Where 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 have you set your minds on? Pretending to be thinking of things above. You find a brother not working. Reading the Bible. You find a brother not working. Reading the Bible. From morning to evening. Shortly after reading the Bible, he's hungry. And he's closing his eyes and pretending to be meditating every now and then. And you're asking, brother, what is happening? My mind is on things above. That approach is another rudimentary approach that needs help. It's another long, long path if we are to begin there as well. Our daily work is part of the Bible. Meeting your personal responsibilities is biblical. But what I can say here in nutshell is in Hebrews chapter 12. But as you set your mind above, let go of every single weight of sin. Twelve verses one. 
Therefore, since we have so great a cloud of witness surrounding us, let us also lay aside every encumbrance and the sin which so easily entangles with us. And let us run with the endurance the race that is set before us. Fixing our eyes on Jesus, the author and finisher of our faith. Let us put aside every single sin and weight that so easily entangles with us. So that our mind can focus on meditating upon things above. Then inspiration can come even how to tackle things here on earth. I say, guard your heart and think about things above. Let us and think about things above. The Lord searches the heart and examines the mind. Because even if you don't set yourself above on things above, we shall be caught off guard. Because when God looks at our hearts, I wonder what he looks there. Because our thoughts are too loud before God. Let us gentlemen. If the topic says guard your heart. First ask, ask your heart which state is your heart? Soko buzo mutima go, mutima guange ndi mumbera chi. I of one. Nzengo mu. I need God for help. Neta agaka tondo kunyamba. On my own I cannot. Nzenga nzo musi sobola. I need him to hold my hand. Neta agangu ate kumukono. I'm such a weak, small living thing. Ndi chira mwe china fe chitone nyu. But when God holds my hand. Na ye katonda bu ankuwa tomu kono. Since he is God almighty. Oro kubanga ye katonda omu yinza webi ntubyo na. My weakness is stricken away. Obu nafu bu ange bunya amburua. And I come up with a very big strength. And I can stand where I could not stand. I want to assure you why you have failed so many times you have tried. It's because you tried on your own. Stop fighting on your own. The battle is not yours. Hand it over. Surrender to the right command. Raise your hands before that commander. Tell him I surrender. So he said. All of you who are weak. All of you who are heavy loaded. He did not say put off the heavy load. He said come to me. And what will I do for you. I will give you rest. Oh Jesus. Yes. What are you tired of? In Matthew 5.8 Paul says blessed are the pure in heart Yes, For they will see God Sometimes we get saved with different intentions Some people got saved to get wives Others got saved to get husbands Others got saved to get the job Because they said it is only for Christian. Others got saved to fit in the family. Because, because the families were born again. Others got saved to please their friends. Ladies and gentlemen, let me assure you the sole purpose of your salvation should be to see God. The mission on your heart 
is to inherit the kingdom of heaven. So that whatever you do, your goal is ahead there. And your goal is internal. Your goal is not physical. Your goal is not here on earth. Your goal is above. And every step you take, you take the you think, Every action you do You ask yourself Will this take me to the, my destination If you realize it is not However profitable it is However good it looks However beautiful it may be Simply because it is not taking me to my destiny I'm sorry I cannot take it up. What is the purpose of your salvation? As you guard your heart, why are you saved? Why are you in this thing? Why are you not drinking alcohol? Why are you not immoral? Why are you not a thief? Your goal should be heaven. The Bible says, First seek ye the kingdom of God and all its righteousness. And all these other things. Sometimes we seek the things that ought to follow us. We forget the kingdom of God. Today, by God's grace. I'm here to remind you, ladies and gentlemen, your sole goal for salvation is your life. Therefore, guard your heart that nothing can distract you on this world. Guard your heart that you may not enter in anything that is stray you away from the church. Guard your heart. That he may follow the strict direction. They are waiting for you. Christ went to prepare a place for us. Now you are being strayed away. No. Come back to your senses. And let us walk the journey. If it was heavy, call on the caller. He is there. He said, call unto me. And I will answer you. But you forgot to call him. Things are getting out of hand. Don't allow them get out of hand. He is waiting for you. We can call our friends. We can call our parents. We can call our bosses. We can call police. We can call them. We can call them. But they can't help us at some point in time. Call on the maker. He is waiting for you. You are a sweet voice. He is waiting for you. He is waiting for you. He is waiting for you. Is missing in heaven. It has been overheard in hell. You cried for the devil. Turn your course right now. Tell the devil enough is enough. You bound me enough is enough. You kept me silent enough is enough. I've been weak enough is enough. Today I'm dressing on my strength. I'm going to call upon the one who called me. I'm going to follow the one who made me. I'm going to follow my father. He's waiting for you. Regardless of whatever has been happening. He's a forgiving father. He loves you. He needs you. The devil has tormented your life. You've done the things you would not wish to do. Some things you can't tell even your neighbor. But the Lord sees them anyway. He does see in darkness. He sees in the pit. Whenever we hide, he does see us. He wants to follow. He wants us to follow him. Let us call the caller. He's waiting for us. 
Let us put off every weight. Leka tuwe yambu le buli echi zitowa. Every sin. Buli chibi. I will not mention them here. Tigenda kubiyo gerera wano kuchituti. But you know the state of your Na yego manye mbera yo mutima go. What have you harbored there? Chiche chocho kwese mu mutima. He searches the heart. Ah, kebere mitima. When he comes to search. Bwa joku kebera. Will he be happy? Ah, na sanyuka. Oh, Jesus. Yesu. You can't be going to hell right now. To sobo la kubango genda musimugeye na kati. Neda. You can't be. To sobo la. You can't be struggling for hell. To sobo la kubaka tingo la fuba ni la genyena. Heaven should be your destiny. E guru. Yeri teke do kubere chiru bidu racha magenda go. You are heavenly material. Gwe, olichi intu cha guru. Remember you are a royal priesthood. Remember, jukira anto oli kabona. You, you are a holy nation. Gwe, oli guanga tukufu. Oh, you are God, this chosen race. Oli don, oli, oli guanga don de liya katonda. Your name is inscribed in his palms. Ama nyago gawa ndiki wa mubibatu ye. And he guards like the apple of his eye. Atenga kukuma nge mwenye yeri soli ye. You cannot be hell's destiny. Tosho wala kube rango ama genda gogali mugeyena. You cannot be. Tosho wala kuba. Today, surrender. Bambi, where were you? Surrender. Where were you? What is it? Chichecho. What can make you get lost that extent? Chichecho, chisobolo kubu zoku tuka kudale yo. He is calling. Aita. He is waiting. Alinda. Some of us, our prayer lives are stricken. Aba muku fobula muwa fobo kusababu wakubwa. It is one of the ways we can guard our hearts. Atenga chechi muku ngeri jetu inzo kumemiti majafi. We cannot guard our hearts when we can't pray. Tetu sobola kumemiti majafi atenga tetu sobola kusaba. Prayer is a constant communication with the heavens. O kusaba ye mpuli ziganya ya feyabuli jone guru. The Lord is ready to restore us. Katonda yete sete so kutuzo buja. Some of us, the word, we cannot read it anymore. When you begin to read, you feel you are dozed. When you read, you feel you can't go any journey. When you begin to read, you are like, where will I take this life? You know what to do, but the strength to do it is so small. Ago kuchikola matono nyo. You have been captured. O wambi dwa. You have been defeated. O wangu dwa. You have been made helpless. O fuli dwa tainabu yambi. Sometime we are stronger in doing evil. O lumu tuliba manyi nyomu kukole echibi. When it comes to doing the will of God, we are so weak. Na yate wabiku tukamu kukolo kwa gala kwa nyo. Tonight. You are changing your destination. It doesn't matter how much you've been tormented. The Lord is ready to receive you once again. And He will restore you. Whether your garments have been dirty. Whether your garments have been stained. Whether your sins are red as scarlet. He will cleanse you. And you will be as white. The reason as why you are listening to this message is because God loves you. It is not His desire that you die in sin. No, it is not His desire to see you go to hell. It is not His desire to see you go to eternal destruction. Therefore, like a fisherman does fish. Today the Lord is fishing you from sin. The Lord is taking you from sin. Just like a lost son did. He went back to his father. And they had to dress him afresh. Tonight. If you are willing. And ready. The Lord is more than willing. To receive you back. To wash you. To cleanse you. To embrace you. To wipe your tears. To speak good words to you once. He's ready. I don't know how ready you are. But let us offer. After offering. 
We are going to pray. We are going to pray. Don't run away at this time like this. Don't turn off your gadgets. Don't switch off from this to another thing. It's the time the Lord is fishing you back. He's bringing you back to his presence. For those who are, who are in Uganda and who can offer through MTN, the code is star 165 star 3 hash. The code is star 165 star 3 hash. Star 165 star 3 hash. It will ask for merchant code. Under merchant code, you enter 315818. Then to request you to enter amount, put the amount you are willing to offer. Then to request, it will bring the summary of the message you've done. Then you press OK. Put, enter, uh, put the pin, then you will complete the transaction. For those who are following on Airtel, the code is star 185 star 9 hash. We hash. will ask you enter um, uh, uh, enter merchant code. The code is 11. Code is 62185. Then request to enter amount. Put the amount you offer. To request you to enter reference. With the reason whether it's tithe, offering, whatever you offer. Then you see the message and enter PIN to confirm. For those away, the bank account bank has been displaying on the screen. Still, we, uh, in case you fire and you can offer over Western Union is also welcome. Then you can call, in case you need further information, these numbers you can give her. 0785. 0 058 0 0 or 0706 or 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 because then those are our numbers, office numbers. We can still keep in touch. You can call me, I'm the administrator. 0782 That is my personal number. But in case you've not found help here, that's a we can follow, we can keep in communication. The same number is on WhatsApp. We can still message ourselves. For those who are offering and those who have offered, let us pray. Father, in the precious name of Jesus, we pray for the offering we are bringing you. May you fill a storehouse. Bless the works of our hands. We will see your goodness in the land of the living. In Jesus' name. Amen. Amen. Ladies and gentlemen, let us offer those who are offering. I know the Lord is Right now, we are going to pray. We have some few minutes to pray. One thing I've realized is that when you are alone, prayer is a little hard. But let's make a corporate prayer. Just know that there are so many people praying with you. Many, many people are praying with you. You are praying, but you are not alone. 
you are not alone. What has put you down? What brought the cracks Chicheche, in your heart? Why did the evil enter? Lwacho mubi ya yingi na mutimago. We need to repent. Tueta go kwenenya. Through repentance. Okuita mukwenenya. We are cleansed. Tulongo sebwa. And when we've been cleansed. Atewe tumalo kulongo sebwa. We don't need, we do not need to go back to the same thing again. Tetueta gate kudda yoku kola bintu byebimu. May God give us the strength. Eka mukama atuwa amanyi. To overcome. Okuwangula. Whatever is overcoming. Bile chibade chituwangula. Ladies and gentlemen. Basebwa ne banyabo. I know Sometimes we are so heavy. Maningo rumu tubera bazitonyo. Sometimes we are so stricken. Rumu tubera tukubidwanyo. And life becomes meaningless. Obulamu no nebubanga obutali mu makuru. And you ask yourself, newebuza, where am I taking this kind of life? Obulamu we chikachi no mbutwalawa. If God is to come right now. Singa katonda wa kudakati. Am I having a candidate really? Dala nange ndi candidate we guru. Will my actions please him? Will my words please him? What is my destiny? What is my destiny? Where is my end? The Bible says you've done all those things and I kept quiet. And you thought I'm the same as you. Sometimes God keeps quiet. And in his silence, he's giving us an opportunity that we may repent. That we may live a holy life. That we may depart from evil. That we may hate evil. I don't know what has bound you. If you feel you're fine, I need help. If you feel your stand is okay, pray with me. I can't pray. I can't read the word. My life is a mess. Sometimes I'm like chicken with that has been slaughtered. I have no direction. I'm a leader. I'm a minister. But how far will this be? If you're fine, don't keep quiet. Pray for me. I need God's grace. Yet His grace abounds forever. Father, in the name of Jesus. We are sorry we have disappointed your spirit. We are sorry we have gone astray. We join up with our brothers online. And we say, Father, forgive us. We have disobeyed your word. We have disobeyed your voice. We have disobeyed your instructions. We have lied to ourselves. Father, here we are. We are sorry. Forgive our disobedience. Our prayer life is stricken. Our life to read the word is stricken. I pray you give us the Holy Spirit this <inaudible> evening. That will quicken our spirit to speak to you. Oh, unto us if we cannot speak to you, Lord. Oh, unto us if we cannot communicate with the caller. Father, we are sorry for our Lord, we are sorry for our thoughts. Lord, we are sorry for our words. Father, we are sorry for the far we've gone. Let your mercy reign. May your forgiveness reign. I'm such a weak living before you. Cast me not away from your presence, O God. 
Redeemer, I need you more than before. So I need you more than yesterday. Father, I need you right now. My soul needs you, oh God. My spirit cries for my you. My Redeemer, hold my hand. I tried on my own and I failed. I tried on my own but I was let down. I tried on my own but I could not. That's why I come and I say I surrender. Redeemer, I surrender. I tried my my own righteousness I could not. Redeemer, hold my hand. My master, hold me by hand. I cannot be a hell's destiny. My Redeemer, I need to be with you. Father, I need to be embraced by you. I need to be with you. Father, I need to feel the weight of your presence. I need to feel the weight of your presence. Father, I need to feel the weight of your presence. Father, I need to feel the weight of your presence. Father, I need to feel the weight of your presence. Draw me closer to you, I pray. Draw me closer to you, I need you. My Redeemer, draw me closer. Here I am before you, my God. Here I am before you, Jehovah. Here I am before you, I pray. Here I am, I need you, Lord. Here I am, I need you, Lord. Here I am, I need you, my power. You said I'm like a harp of your eye. Right now I cannot do it on my own. Restoration is my desire. Restoration is my cry. Restoration is my cry. Restore my life, my redeemer. Restore my life, my maker. Restore my life once again. I want to be like you. Lord, I want to follow you. Plus, I want to please you. Father, I want to serve you. My redeemer, I want to walk with you. Father, I want to move with you. Redeemer, I need to be embraced by you. Oh, Jesus. 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 Bring me closer to you once again. Bring me closer to your desire. My master help my spiritual man. My redeemer help my thoughts. I have harbored evil inside of me. Help me Lord separate from evil. My master help my brothers online. Help those who are listening over the radio. Help those following over the media. My master may embrace them. For those whose lives are stricken, for those who feel they are under captivity, for some may you set them free. We need the freedom from you, Lord. We need the freedom from you, Master. As your word is a priest like this, O God, may your spirit descend, O God. Give us the grace to come. Give us the grace to descend. Give us the grace to come before you. Give us the grace to come before you. My Redeemer, I need you. My wife needs you. My wife needs you, Lord. My children need you. My brothers need you. My neighbors need you. They may be wise on their own. Without you, we are empty. Without you, we are nothing. Without you, we are lying ourselves. Masa, come and embrace us. Welcome Holy Spirit Into my life today I know I need your presence I know I need you Lord Without you Lord I'm empty Without you I'm nothing Without you Lord I'm nothing here I am. 
received me as a lost son. Take away the filthy garments. I know they can't help me any longer. Take away the evil thoughts from me. me. Take away the sins that have harbored in my Take heart. Take away the anger. Take away morality. My redeemer, take away the last of us. Take away everything inside of me. That is so easily entangles with me. I want to be free. I want to follow you. I want to serve you out of a pure heart. I want to walk with you the rest of my life. I want to be closer to you. Need I need to feel the warmth of your presence. Lord, you are my own. From darkness you called me. From sin you snatched me. From death, Father, you called me. Right now, Lord, I need you support. Redeemer, help me stand. On my own, I'm nothing. On my own, I'm empty. Father, let your presence come, Lord. As I guard my heart, I need you, Jesus. Redeemer, you said in your word, all of you who are heavy, loaded, and burdened, Come unto me and I will give you rest. Here I am of come. The sin have loaded me and heavy on me. The guilt has been heavy on me. My redeemer have descended closer to you. I pray you come and help me go back to my position. My redeemer hold me by hand. Lead me through and I follow you. Redeemer lead me that I may follow you. You. Let me, Lord, I may walk with you. My redeemer have walked alone and have staggered and fallen. Lord, I walked alone and have gotten lost. To My redeemer, your spirit is discovering me this evening. I pray, Lord, hold me by heart. Lead me through the path of righteousness. May you word be the lamp unto my feet. May you word be my food daily. May you word be sweeter than honey like it was in May you word be part of my menu. May you word be with me. May I meditate upon you day and night. That the book of the law shall never depart from my May I have it, O Jesus. Holy Spirit, give me Strength. Holy Spirit, help me through. Holy Spirit, you're the helper. Remind me to read the word. Remind me to remain faithful. Remind me to stand straight with the Lord. Remind me to walk with my Father. Remind me to walk with you. Hold me by hand. Here I am. Zuno. I choose to give myself away. To you, Lord, I give myself. To you, Father, I give myself. To you, redeem, I give myself. Jesus, receive me once again. My redeemer, my spirit is lost. My spirit cannot go for destruction forever. My purpose of salvation is to follow you. My purpose of salvation is heaven. My redeemer take all the destructions around my way. I want to walk with you, Jesus. For my sake, you are stricken. For my sake, you were crucified. For my sake you came For my sake you were embarrassed For my sake you put on the shame Jesus yes. Hold me by hand Help me follow you Help me follow you 
May I know the purpose of the salvation. May I consider the value of salvation. May I consider the purpose of your coming. You came to redeem me. Here I am. Here I am. Restore my life once again. Restore my heart once again. Restore my thoughts once again. Restore me once again. Hold me wherever I'd gotten lost my master. Bring me back to your presence. I will follow you. I will walk with you all the days of my life. I surrender my family before you. I surrender my children before you. As character transformation takes place, may they guard their hearts. May they have you as their maker. None of them shall depart from you. None of them shall serve the enemy. None of them shall be a dismay to the church. None of them will be a reproach to the nation. Lord, I surrender them. May your presence cover us, O God. I surrender my listeners. I surrender our viewers of God. Must I give them the strength to overcome the sin that I don't want? Redeemer, give them the strength to remain faithful. Lord, give them the strength to stand the test of time. Let them be filled of your word, O God. It's my prayer that let them stand at faith. Oh, Jesus. We need you more than before. We need you more than yesterday. We need you, Jesus. May we not grow cold in this generation. May I not grow cold in this generation. May I not grow cold in this generation. May I not grow weary when I am the May I not get tired of Jesus. I pray you renew my strength like an eagle. I need to walk, Lord. Some roads are heavy. Some roads, Lord, are rough. Some roads are mountainous. Others have steep valleys. Others have stones, O Lord. But give me the grace to walk on this journey. The Bible says your ways pass through fire. Your ways pass through water. Your ways pass through world wind. Jesus. Yes. You are the strength giver. Give me the strength. Give me the strength. Hold my hand. Take me to your side. Take me by your side. I want to be called your son. I want to be called your friend. I want to be called your bride. Oh I want to be closer to you. Father, what can it benefit me? To eat the whole world and lose my own soul. May I walk with you Jesus. May I serve with you. May I feel you. I break the powers of darkness. I demolish the presence of the enemy. That is praying away people from the way of the Lord. I refuse every accusing tongue. I demolish every presence of darkness. Whatever had come to take us away. Whatever wants to direct us from the way of the Lord. Whatever wants to make us the gifts of hell. Right now we refuse it. 
We reject the influence of the devil and we call upon the presence of God to come and take charge. Father, we thank you. We bless you. We love you. We love you. We thank you, Jesus. You are such a loving Father. You are such a loving God. You are such a loving King. My Redeemer, in your kingship, you come and dwell with the sons of men. Who are we? Thank you, Jesus. Thank you for loving us. Thank you for being our friend. Thank you for being our father. Thank you for drawing us close. In Jesus' name. Amen. Amen. For those who are following us and would like to surrender your life to Christ. Or you would like to recommit your life to Christ once again. And you feel you need to have a new journey. And you need a new walk. The grace is sufficient. The grace is sufficient. The Lord called you for a purpose. And the purpose is eternity. He did not call you to destroy you. He did not call you to be the firewood in hell. But he called you to enjoy with him in eternity. And if you're ready to surrender your life once again. You can repeat these words. Say Jesus. Here I am. I surrender before you. I repent of all my sins. All that I know. That and I don't know. I pray for your forgiveness. Draw me closer to you. Rub my name from the books of those who are going to hell. And write in the books of those who are going to heaven. Today I recommit myself. And I pray, Holy Spirit, come and lead me through. Hold my hand that I may grow. And I please the Lord. Thank you. In Jesus' name. Amen. Amen. We love you. If you've made such a prayer, it may be a new beginning. One thing I pray, don't give up. Recommit your life to Christ. Pray. Read the word. Follow the word. Do the word. Read the word. Follow the word. Do the word. Let the word be the basis of your Christianity. I know you will grow to please the Lord. There is a divine purpose at which you were created. And there is a divine reason as to why you are still alive. You are not any better than our four people who have passed away. But there is a divine reason as to why you are alive. And that purpose can come to pass if your life is surrendered to the Lord. Our conference is still going on. Tomorrow we are still here. That's Friday, Saturday we are here. Sunday we are here full time. And one thing I know, the Lord has sent us the word at such a time like this for Struggle as much as possible and follow be the doers of the word like we are enjoying the sermons and we are blessed it gets a little heavy for us the organizers we have to get internet mbps which is much more stable and we need to have gadgets that are better, are working well. 
I want to have a staff that are dedicated to this. For this reason, do not get weary of doing good. If God has put it upon your spirit to partner with Inner Man Ministries financially, do not hesitate. Allow the Lord to work with you. For, the, for that reason, He gave you the power to make wealth. Time is at such a time like this. Much money is needed. Depending on the current economic situation. Where there is no congregation. In Uganda we are in lockdown still. Yet we need to minister to the soul. We call upon ladies and gentlemen who can stand with the ministry financially. You call these numbers. Like those on screen, the numbers you've been reading on the screen. And you can let us know how you are standing with us. For those who are listening over the radio, the number is our user number 0785. 058-058-540-050-050-050-050-050-050-050-050-050-050-050-050-050-050-050-050-050-050-050-050-050-050-050-050-050-050-050-050-050-050-050-050-050-050-050-050-050-050-050-050-050-050-050-050-050-050-050-
Kwata linki. Send to as many people as you can. Kakati ya uloji sindi kila bantu banji ngabo osobola. Those on Facebook. Habali ku Facebook. Invite as many people as you can. Nawe yingi za mwa bantu banji ngabo osobola. Ideally minister with us. Where is our Munafi? I've uh, I've seen so many people do this. Uh, my friend, uh, my friend Romans, you've done this so well. In the United Arab Emirates, and United my Arab friend Emirates. Uh, Juliet, you've done it so well. Uh, my friend Juliet, you've done it so well. Uh, Juliet, you've done it so well. 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 You've done like the page then i will also be like okay let me like the page once again do i yagala kula message nga zetu rude mpaka weziko maoje ndinga nange bansa bo kwagala omukutu gwawe let us do it intentionally leka tuchikole nga tuchigenderedde the way you are blessed engeri jo wereddo omukisa there are so many people who need to be blessed be bantu banji na babeta go kuwebo omukisa go wereddo them no lwecho banirize i love you so much bagala nyo mwenna my name is konadi sande amanya gegego let's hear the words of the grace katugama ne bigambe byechisa that may the grace chisa cha mukama of our jesus christ and the love of God, and the fellowship of the Holy Spirit, be with us all, now and forever. Amen. May God bless you. We love you. Stay tuned. Tomorrow we are continuing with our conference. Thank you. Steva Christian High School, located in Nakaseke Town, Kapeka Road, near Nakaseke Hospital. For more information, call 0776-507780 or 0701-507780. Steva Christian High School, the best school to go to.